Hello, Freedom Seekers. Jeremy Chambers. Lucas Chambers. Who? Lucas Chambers. Lucas Chambers. We're out here on the shore of Lake Huron, here just north of Port Huron in Michigan. And uh, doing something a little different today. We're not on the homestead. We're not going to be talking about homestead stuff. As a matter of fact, today is all about enjoying a little bit of nature. More specifically, we're out here with the group looking for interesting rocks, fossils, and gemstones. So for those of you that don't know, Michigan is a peninsula. We are surrounded by what are known as the Great Lakes. And throughout the Great Lakes, there is such a wonderful variety of diversity of stones, gemstones, and fossils. There are fossils that are coral out here in the middle, sea coral, saltwater coral, out here in the middle of Michigan. And they make up a lot of the rock formations uh, that we find along many of the Great Lakes. One of the most popular ones is called the Potowski Stone, which is actually just a fossilized coral. And we are out here today looking for different fossils. We've met with a group of people to discuss fossils. We're going to be looking at how some of the rocks and stones and fossils are polished in order just to make them look a little nicer. So we're just going to be out here combing this beach uh, here at the Fort Gratiot County Park in order to try to find some of these fossils or some interesting rocks. Find anything interesting yet, Mark? All right, so this one here is some type of coral, fossilized coral. And this is a pretty interesting formation here. There, Luke. Uh, another gentleman gave it to me. It is a piece of horn coral, and it definitely looks like a horn. It looks like a horn. Oh, the other pieces are broken in half that I have. Yeah, so. that is a beautiful piece. All right. Sometimes when you're out fossil and you know gemstone hunting, you come across things that just are pretty, and it's important to not just discount those because there might be something of value, even if there's not necessarily a value in the stone itself. Sometimes there's just a value in the memory of where you got it. So sometimes we come home with rocks that aren't necessarily anything impressive, they're just pretty. So one of the great things about events like this is it gives a chance for old and young alike to come together, uh, experience something that they all enjoy, and for new people to this uh, hobby, literally get their feet wet. So everybody's here to learn, to share, to explore, just enjoy the Michigan beach. And uh, one of the really cool things is they actually have some equipment over here to be polishing some stones later on. So they're gonna be doing a cabbing demonstration a little later on uh, and showing us just exactly how their um, polishing system works here. Some people choose to polish, some people choose to tumble. Find anything good, Luke? Good. You left your bowl up there, so. Uh, oh, is that there? Anything in there? Let's see. Right there. Oh, a piece of horn coral. Nice. Looks good. Quartz. You guys can come on in a little closer if you want to get a little closer. Uh, there's six wheels. The coarser grit starts on your left. This is a real hard uh, coarse grit, like 60 grit. 120 grit, I think this is 280 grit, 600, 1200, and you get down all the way to your 3000. Whatever wheel you're using, you just make sure you turn on the water so that you got some water dripping. Always wear glasses because it's 
stuff does fly off now and then. Some people will wear a mask or a respirator. But you just make sure you got water dripping, keep the snow wet and the wheel wet, light pressure, and use the whole wheel and go back and forth up and down. All right, so we've finished up our day here out at the Fort Gratiot County Beach and Park uh, looking for fossils and rocks, all kinds of interesting things. Had a great calving demonstration up in the pavilion uh, for polishing rocks. And uh, it's time for us to be done for the day. <laughs> We're all a little tired and ready to just head out. We had a great day, it was wonderful to be here. Thanks for joining us on this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss out on any future adventures. And as always, God, God bless.